before we move any farther, I want to point out something here. So we're using the 0.24.0 version that it was available when I started building Heartbeat um, almost like a year ago from when I'm recording this video. And um, this particular version is based upon a, another um, two main dependencies, right? So the Chrome version, and, or the Chromium I should say, and the Node version. Recently Node upgraded to the 10th version and with that came something interesting. Um, to introduce you to that I want to show you something here. For example this particular package, the NEDB package, works on the basis of callbacks. So do you remember we implemented this callback um, function here that will be used whenever we are modifying our data, right? Or an insert or update. But at the same time, after using that style of code to use the callbacks and to comply with the API of the of the library, then we wrap the whole thing in a promise so that when we use our action, the story mode action will be returning an actual promise and we can do the dot then over there where where you're using the action. And although we could do this, we could manually probably wrap the native module or package that we want to import from Node. Uh, this is going to be the FS. FS. Even though we could do this, just require FS and then wrap all its API in a promise and then return it. Something I would uh, like to do is to upgrade the NW package or the NW version that we're using so that it leverages a newer API that is available from the node version 10 and on. And you'll see that latest stable is going to be using Chromium 69 as well as node 10 10 0 right and this is a little quick view into what I'm talking about this is experimental FS promises um, I guess technically we shouldn't be doing this in a production app but since this is still like an experiment for me I think I'm on the safe side by using it so uh, yeah there was this version 8 of Node which introduced uh, this library to wrap all the functions uh, that provided a callback API into the promise but in this particular version uh, the functions of the FS are returning promises directly so uh, effectively we don't need to add another step there so this is what we were aiming for to have our code base a little bit simpler so let's uh, move on with that then so what I want to do now is to go to the package version and just uh, bump up these these two. So it was the uh, 33.3. We're going to save this. And once I did that, I can run the application. And you'll see it will now download the newer version. So cool. It doesn't seem like anything broke so far 